65 Gamer Guy here with a review of Root Beer Tapper for the ColecoVision. In this game your job is to serve these extremely thirsty root beer patrons, I guess you'd call them. Man, do they love root beer. Now this game is based on a arcade game of the same name, which I think originally was just called Tapper, and it had a uh, Budweiser logo and it served beer and I guess they thought that that was uh, not a good thing for kids to be seeing so they made root beer tapper as a different version and I don't know what the whole backstory is I don't know if they made both of them at the same time and just put the tapper in bars or if they made tapper first and decided it was not good for kids to be playing it so they change it to root beer tapper or what the whole story is. I'm sure Wikipedia or someplace got information about that but I haven't looked it up. And every third or fourth screen or so you get this little bonus round where the little bad guy comes out and shakes up the cans and you have to figure out which one he didn't shake so you don't get splashed in the face. This game is uh, really fun. It's got pretty good graphics. It's got a lot of cute little animations where if you don't serve all the patrons or if they get to the end of the bar, I mean, they'll throw you out of the bar. So the arcade had other animations where it'd throw the, the beer mug or the mug up in the air and sometimes it would land on his head and sometimes he'd try to kick it with his foot and it would wind up hurting him and he'd kind of bounce around for a little bit. Now this game, I think, has all the same screens as the arcade, but I'm not 100% sure on that. And the difficulty level does increase as you play it. It gets 
pretty hard, but it's not ridiculously hard. After some of the patrons drink their root beer, if they don't slide off the screen, sometimes they will leave a tip. And you can see it. It's a little green and gold thing. It looks like a little dollar bill and a few coins laying there. And if you pick that up, the uh, there's a... I don't know what you call it. Some girls come out and dance and some of the patrons will turn and watch that instead of moving forward so it gives you a little bit of time if you need it to clean up the the mugs and stuff like that because you can't let any of the mugs slide off the bar because if any mug slides off the bar and crashes then you lose a life or if you send one too many root beers out it'll crash off the other end of the bar and you lose a life This is a really fun game. It's one of my favorites. It's not the favorite. But it's a fun and addictive game. Keep wanting to play it over and over. And 
don't have to play in this game and watch it. If it was Tapper and they were all drinking beer, you'd have a serious problem on your hand because these people would get drunk pretty fast. The way they sucked down this root beer, or if it was beer. Can't imagine what that would be like. I'm not sure I want to. Five Gamer Guy here. Thanks for watching and happy gaming.